Bloody hell, John, make me jump. <laughs> I think we're stuck. We're stuck. Yeah. I'm going to go right over here. All clear on approach. Good. Seems a bit drier this side. Well, it's it's a mixture of being one drier and two less rabbit holes. Front tank, got plenty of fuel, make neat toes around both. Full and free controls. Looks a bit softer here. Yeah. Maybe not a good idea. Very soft there, John. Yeah, I thought we'd sign over there. I'll be, on, you. <laughs> I'll be on that. Yeah. I'm going to run through that really thick stuff. Yeah, thank you. Are you basically happy? Yep, good to go. Rabbit holes that I need to be aware of. This is where I went in really deep, although I think John went in deeper. Okay, here we go. Down the hill we go! Down the hill we go. Hey, we're up. First time this year. <laughs> Good for you. It's pretty flooded over there. Yeah. Well, that was very, very sticky at the top. Yeah, very. Certainly feel it, didn't you? Yeah. See you okay? Yeah, yeah. It's uh, not as crystal clear as I was wondering if it might be. Could just about see the mast that Manic through. Yeah. Oh, no, there's plenty of visibility, but I was... Yeah. I was sort of expecting it to be, you know, one of these crystal clear days. Yeah. So does it seem strange without the SEPA? Oh, very. Yeah. Yeah, very strange. Have you heard anything from him? No, not at all, no. No. Uh, apart from the day that he took it. Yeah. So the last time I flew was the 4th of December. Right. Yeah. And it was much like a day like this, actually. Yeah. Well, strangely enough, I mean, what are we now, the 19th? Yeah. Well, with the 19th, I flew on the 4th, which, yeah, it's longer than I would like. Yeah. But actually, it's not too long. Yeah. Bearing in mind some of the layoffs that I have had, but actually, it seems a lot longer than that. John's on a right. Okay. Close right. Oh, high right. right. Yeah. There's quite a lot of water around. Yeah. Oh, he's over there now. The orange on the wings stick out well, doesn't they? It does today. And also the, the prop, the two, di two different colours, the black and the white. Yeah. Happy? Yeah. Um, excessively high figures for the EGT, EGT and the CHT. They're normally sort of balanced on the straight. Oh, right. This mixture is fully rich. Yeah. 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 I think basically... It's coming down, though. Yeah, I think really what I was doing was for that... I had a, a more power on for most of that run 
Yeah. Simply because I was trying to pull it through the mud. Yeah. Because I normally sort of put it on fairly slowly. Yeah. And as and a increase, gradual yeah. increase. But also, what I couldn't understand was the fact that we seem to have got a, a, a pressure of 10.44. Yeah, that's what was forecast today also. Was it? Yeah. yeah. Very high, isn't it? It is, yeah. He's in one of those moods where he doesn't want to sort of stay level. Yeah. He's just sort of Drift swinging it, a it around a bit. Oh, we had to jump start it again. Well, so what did it? Did it stopped or? No, he stopped it. Right. Because uh, I gave him his phone and locked his car up. Yeah. And uh, then he went to go start it again. It didn't want to start. All right. Oh well, the run should do it a little bit of good, shouldn't it? I know that if I just do my steady Eddie bit, then he can do his bit. Yeah. He can do whatever he wants to. But in doing so, I do try to keep the speed up. Yeah. In the back here. Yep. Do you want to just hold it for a second or sure. two? Yep, I've got control. You have control. Is he still there? Yep, still there. Oh, it's nice and close, that. Yeah. Trouble is, as always. On the camera, it doesn't look like it, though, does it? Uh, I mean, Natalia did really well with that when you had the 18 with the Seeper. Yeah. But I think what also worked nicely on that one was the fact that because she had it on zoom, it actually made you look closer than you actually were. Because some people are saying that I only do sort of passing shots right. of the panel. So, oil temperature, pressure, airspeed in knots, climb and descent, altimeter, radio, EFIS. Transponder. A little mirror that a lot of people talk about, but it is quite handy to see when you've got people in the back. I mean, it was good when Sophia was in the back. It just meant I could keep an eye on, yeah. see how she was doing. Turn and slip. Carb temperature gauge. And then we have got a working ECG and CHT. And Which is couple to normal. Yeah, a couple of people commented that one side of that is dead. Well, yeah, it is dead, but to be honest, and I'll show everybody in a minute, RPM, and then, of course, I use the iPad, the iPad with uh, the Garmin Glow. But a couple of people have asked, but as far as I'm concerned, everything to do with the electrical system comes up here on the EFIS. If I come down below there, there's sound recording, fuel cock. I have turned off that carbon monoxide detector because it was bleeping like mad. Oh, In was it? Yeah. Intercom. Kevin heats the blue one, mixtures the yellow one, and then we've got switches. Oh, we've got the throttle, we've got carb heat, we've got landing light, nav light, and then there's the alternator fuse next to that. The black one there is a dead one, doesn't happen. Master is the red one. And that, I think, is basically the panel. If you just keep running straight. Yep, okay. I'm just well, keeping an eye on John yeah. in a minute. Um, it's just I've got some interesting sort of 
how they're barges that are in the mud. It's some sort of protection, coastal protection. Song's coming round. Yep. Speed are we doing? That's right. Keep going straight or we'll turn? Well, we can come, come left. Follow him round. Oh, I see them now. If you want to head over there towards the park, yep. I turned that down because of whoever it was was talking. Well, whoever was making that strange noise. <laughs> The only trouble is if I turn it down, I can't always hear if John's saying anything. Trouble is when you fire through the prop without an ND filter, you just get lined. Yeah. Which way do you want me to go? Yeah, if you head out to the point okay. and then run down, then that means that I can fire out through that window. Yep. I noticed that uh, Ben in one of his latest videos did a little bit about taking photographs with his iPhone oh, by okay. comparison to somebody who was using a really fancy camera. Yeah. And what a day for it. It's beautiful, man. You see the avenue of trees for Sirencester Park? You can fly over that actually today. It's just going to slow up a little bit. Gorgeous day. Isn't it amazing? I mean, <laughs> mad. This is a mad hobby. <laughs> we can fly pretty much up the avenue of trees, which is pretty nice. Yeah, the only problem with um, going that way onto it is the props in the way for the photos. Oh, uh, what? Sorry, the the prop. Oh, uh, okay. Well, we can come. I tell you what. If we come at it, if yeah. we fly across the end of it, then I well, can get it that. through the side. Okay. Just lift that wing. There's nothing coming. So, shall I? If we're going to get photos of a bit of the avenue in the house, yeah, need to kind of cut across it. Okay. Happy with those? It's very hard. Is it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I bet. Oh wow, yeah. I mean, still, that's that's pretty cool, mate. It should be all right. Yeah. You see a bit of the flooding in the fields around this. Yeah. Of That lake is just flat, calm, look. Yeah. Little. Um, the whole point is, if you're flying, your primary job is to fly, isn't yeah, it? That's it? Yeah, So, I mean, I'm quite enjoying this because it means that I get a chance to, to film, yeah. knowing that you, as a pilot, yeah. I hasten to add, um, <laughs> are doing all the flying. John's just coming underneath us now. Oh, is he? Okay. Yeah, way underneath us. Look at the way that water is breaking out there. Yeah. Must be over the sand somewhere. There's quite a few ships in. Yeah. Okay, if you make a gentle turn to the left. Okay. Yeah, that's a, that's enough. Keep running as we are now. Keep going straight for a while, please. Yep. Now we can come left again. I've got a bit of glare on the screen, which means it's a bit difficult to know exactly what's happening. Well, I hope it's a glare on the screen and not a glare on me camera lens. I'm just going to come that side. So we've got the sun coming round to our left now. Yeah, uh, it'll do for a while. I normally only ever get the docks in a corner of a shot, you know yeah. what I mean? Is that two lighthouse boats out there? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I didn't know they were there. Um, I knew there'd been one for some time, but I didn't realise that there were two. Yeah. There's one at Tollsbury, well yeah. it was, I don't know if it still is. Because of course they're all redundant now, aren't they? Yeah. 
I was going to say, head over it, which way? Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to cough. <laughs> I just thought I'd better warn you. Actually, when you look back towards Nayland, it's actually very murky. Yeah, it is. Go off Oscar, you on frequency, straight on it. Uh, go off Oscar, on frequency. You can't see Manning Tree and Miss Lee, can you? Well, we got Pit Mill down there. Yep. Oh, no, we can't hit Granny Sierra, leaving the zone. Is that to the first the one there? Down. Yeah. A lot of my sailing buddies always sailed there. I never ever did get there in the end. It's a well known stretch of the old world. That should be quite a nice shot yep. of the old world bridge. It looks reasonably quiet at the moment. It does, yeah. Right, if you can give me a 50 degree right. Uh, John's on me right at the minute. Alright, oh, okay, coming over the top. Okay. Head in that direction. I don't know whether you've taken the girls to see it, but moored in the uh, marina part in the middle of Ipswich yeah. is a half size replica of Noah's Ark. I didn't know that. Um, and it's only there, I can s you can see it there now. This side of the waterway, yep. in between those two big flats, it just looks like a very large barge. Oh, okay. Can you see it there? Yeah. Run, run straight. Just stabilise up a bit. Yeah. But there's lots of exhibits in it, which is quite interesting, apparently. Yeah. John's been, John took his grandchildren. Oh, did he? Yeah. If you want to run on until you pick up the 14 and 12. Yep. Okay. Be prepared. Being shoved around. And if you get his weight turbulent. Even on tick over, there's a lot of draft that comes off of that aeroplane. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It blows your hat off. Yeah. I mean, you can either follow the roads around, or you can go via Raiden Wings. I think we go, well, trouble is, being in the sun, you can't do much filming, can you? No, 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 this is virtually it. I'm yeah. going to shut the main cameras down now. Well, if you want to, yep. rather than go in, yep. just go over to viewers, have a look at the dragon, come around and come back. Okay. I always find it coming back this way, so do I just carry straight ahead? Yeah, you or is it need just more to, to be, the well, if we if we go, if we stay as we are, but then when we do a turn, we do a turn to the right. Yeah. From here, the dragon is on the other side of the slope. What, past the, that's the village there, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, I mean, we're, so we're right, your, right, isn't it? Yeah. Bloody hell, John, made me jump. <laughs> Bloody hell, John, made me jump. <laughs> I got the drag on my side. Well, the end of the 5428, Charlie, uh, rejoining the circuit from the north. Keep coming uh, around, Lev. Yeah. Uh, okay, straight point. there. Oh, the end of the circuit, Charlie, go left. off, Oscar. Facing overhead for an overhead joint. Okay, sharper. There we go. There we are. Lovely. Thank you very much. Head back to the airfield. Nailing traffic, Golf Alpha Yankee Echo Hotel is in the overhead, Nailing traffic.
still trying to see whether we've got marks in the grass where we took off. Oh, I see. <laughs> we'll go back and have a look at those on the ground. Okay, bring yourself around to the two, two reservoirs. reservoirs. Traffic Golf Alpha Yankee Echo Hotel downwind the pan and we are at 1,300 feet mainland traffic. Okay, fuel pump is coming back on because okay. we have to do a landing off the front tank. So I'm now on the front tank. Carpet as we need it, mixture is rich, harness is okay, hatch is Call okay. Carly, Carly, turning final, one eight by hand. Okay, come left to the other reservoirs. Okay, right back into the white. Further back, further back, further back. And do you want me to drop the air brake? Or are you going to do it? Uh, I'll do it. Yeah. No, 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 that's it. That's, that's, the, the, that's the brake. Okay, okay. I got a Fosco just turning the fire. Push. Got it. Okay, got it, yep. And then... Around you come. Where are you, Tim? I can't see you visually. Just about the turn final. Do you mind if I... No, you take control. I have control. Okay. Got it to the doorstep. Yeah. Thank you very much. Well, no, thank you very much. It meant I could do a whole lot of stuff that otherwise I wouldn't have been able to have done. Of Echo Hotel over the river, late final. It's a bit bumpier down here than I thought. Yeah. Yeah, a whole lot of people on the top of the hill on the right hand side. Got them? Yep. Mainland traffic, Gulf Julia, Bravo, long time with contact one head. What a lovely landing. Thank you. I think the secret with all of this really is much as you feel a little bit worried about doing it, just you need to keep a bit of power on. Yeah. You know, because the, it, the strip looks short. Um, I'm doing this for rabbit hole purposes. Well, what a lovely flight. Thank you very much for and the company. And a half sub tan face. <laughs> and for those people who were watching the video, hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, tick like. Please leave me a comment. Share with anybody who you might be thinking, who might think, you know, uh, you, you yeah, share I'll with anybody <laughs> who you think <laughs> might like it. And subscribe if you haven't already. I should be able to do that bit, the amount of off, times I've done off it. Off my heart, yeah. <laughs> anyway, hopefully I'll see you again next week. Oh, should we go and have a look at those ruts? <laughs> <laughs> this bit here, I think that was, that was John when he said that he thought it nearly tipped up, but I think ours are further up here. Oh, and it sounds a little bit on the squelchy side. So I think we're going to have to try and get the, the roller out on that 